to today's daily devotional reading from Vitality for Daily Living, authored by the Prophet Daniel Ejahon Afari. Today is Thursday, 9th February 2023. The topic for today is, God has not finished with you yet. And our anchor scripture is taken from Ecclesiastes chapter 3, verse 1. I'm reading from the King James Version. To everything there is a season and a time to every purpose under the heaven. Now today's inspiration. Even God, who is all powerful, used six days to create the earth. It is very important to know that Rome was not built in a day. But the fruit of the Spirit is love, joy, peace, patience, kindness, goodness, faithfulness, gentleness, and self-control. Galatians chapter 5, verse 22 to 23. Patience, they say, is a virtue. True, in today's world, the microwave generation, as I call it, people are always pushing to get so many things swiftly. For example, many of the youth are in a rush to own luxury cars, estates, and even women. I believe in them. They are all good. But by patience, diligence in serving the Lord, and hard work, all of these needs will come to you with time. Seek first the kingdom of God and its righteousness, and all the other things will be given to you. A caterpillar craved to fly like a butterfly any time it saw them fly. He will go to God and request to fly too. But God will always reply by saying, God has not finished with you yet. Due to its ignorance that a caterpillar is a stage in the life of a butterfly, it could not develop the patience to wait. It sometimes invents its own wings and tries to fly. But it will fail, fall, and get hurt. This happened for a time until when the right time came. It fell asleep and by the time it woke up, it broke off its cover only to discover it could fly. In God's appointed time, he will make all things beautiful. And I tell you, he will surely make your life a wonder. Just learn to be patient and wait upon the Lord. Let us pray. Everlasting Father, you know the end of a matter from the beginning thereof. Help me to develop patience by your Holy Spirit and never let me miss out on my set times and season in Jesus' name. Amen. To read the Bible in one year. For today, please read Leviticus chapter 7 to chapter 9 and Matthew chapter 25 verse 31 to 46. Thank you and God bless you.